A good one, for sure. Uh, always makes me happy no, to see the, the car for the first time uh, completed. This, is, this was actually five minutes ago now, and uh, I'm still digesting it and trying to turn around to have a look because it looks really beautiful. Uh, again, uh, another step more beautiful compared to last year. I think the, the red is a bit more alive, no? a bit more bright. The, um, the car is a bit more styled, a bit more redefined, looks like a good evolution from last year, uh, a lot more detail in it, and yeah, I cannot wait to drive it. Obviously to try and improve those numbers, no? but uh, I think the priority this year to, for the team is to make another step forward, uh, like we did last year, now we want to do another step and definitely get in that fight for the World Championship, for all the race wins, and yeah, try and be as competitive as we can, but at the same time, trying to improve in all the areas that we've set ourselves uh, the goals. It's been a bit of a long winter um, because the season finished a bit earlier than, than what it used to be. So I managed to start my training probably also a bit earlier than, than other years uh, as I got the rest done earlier on. And yeah, it, it has felt long this, this let's say, two months in a, since I started my training program. Um, I focus myself maybe a bit more in the cardio side. Normally I've been lifting a lot of weights, trying to gain weight, but now I'm nearly at the limit of my of my of the weight limit of the of what a driver is allowed to to weight. I have to focus more on the cardio side. So yeah, I'm working on it as much as possible, and uh, I feel fresh, fit, like always. my most Italian skill or behavior. Um, that's a tricky one. Uh, I think I, most of my behaviors are very similar to Italians. And uh, I feel that when I'm around the mechanics, when I'm around the engineers, uh, obviously people know, know now by now that I live in Italy. So I feel very Italian in all the ways that I behave and I go about here in Italy. but. Uh, yeah, behaviors, one particular one, I'm not sure. Maybe the antipasti before, before lunch for me are very difficult to take out of my diet. Now that I'm trying to lose a kilo before the first race is probably one of the most difficult things to, to avoid. Yeah, for sure. I mean, we, we have to, no? Uh, we have a lot of fi fun away from the circuits. This year we have 23 races, so there's going to be a lot of free time in between uh, one back-to-back -back race where we stay in a city or where we have to go somewhere else. And I'm keen to be as competitive as we are on track with him, as we are on paddle or, or any other sport we play that uh, I'm sure we're going to have uh, fun and, and enjoy it. 